I'm gonna show you a song that you may or may not have heard before. Okay. Ooh! That sounds like a hand crossover. How does she know? This is crazy! So this, this figuring it out is tricky. Woo! <laughs> this is awesome. because it's like exploding. <laughs> Hi, I'm Victoria Theodore. I'm a pianist, singer, songwriter, composer, music director, and cool person. <laughs> Would you call yourself a perfectionist? Oh boy. If I don't have enough time to practice something, I get very upset <laughs> because I want to be able to do 100% fantastic every time. I'm gonna show you a song that you may or may not have heard before. Okay. And I would love for you to learn this song here. Wow. Are you ready? Let's go! Okay. Wow. Whoa. Okay. hand goes to octaves. Well, that's a busy left hand. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Oh, that sounds like a hand crossover. How she know? Or maybe it's just iPad. Crazy song in F. Okay. <laughs> Stop, please. All right, so the left hand starts with a C. How in the world? It sounds like two pianists, I swear. How's it? Because he's not with the, the first. It almost sounds like they're happening at the same time, which makes me think it's two pianists, because you can't, unless. Maybe that. Oh my god. Uh, okay. I think that must be what they're doing. All right, that's the first bar. <laughs> this is crazy. Okay. I'm definitely hearing that at the top. And I don't think that's possible. No. There's no way. Because I definitely... One more time for the top. Okay. Maybe that. This is a really tricky thing. I mean, in classical music, you see it a lot where you don't have the hand <laughs> to play all three of those at the same time, so you break it. So it's really, a, you have to think of it as a drop. All right, we got two phrases down. Boom. Woo! Woo! Smack that up. That's what it sounds like. It sounds like something else happening though. It's, it's, it's figuring it out that's tricky. No. <laughs> it still doesn't sound right. Oh well. Change the count. Interesting. This is awesome. All right, one more time, please. You're blowing our minds. I'm blowing my own mind because it's like exploding. <laughs> what a mess. Always go slower if you're having trouble. <laughs> Okay, 
Am I playing it with a recording or by myself? I think you should play it by yourself. Okay. lots of errors but if that's part of it then okay how did you feel about that experience that was a really good experience it's always useful to do something that's challenging and new to discover where you need to work what things you need to continue to develop because music is never ending that, that piece is called cornfield chase oh it's from a TV show it's from a movie and oh it's I think I made is that the one where the aliens talk to the people Probably. That's a piece by Hans Zimmer. Oh, wow. It's beautiful. The arrangement you played was by Dorian Marco. Ah. What did you think of his arrangement? I thought the arrangement was beautiful. It's very challenging. It's technically, trying to figure out all by ear was really challenging and difficult. <laughs> I'm so glad we're done. <laughs> that was fun, but my brain is quite tired. <laughs>